Hello, humans and sources. This is Lofo and today we are gonna be here for episode zero of a new gameplay series. Yes, that's it. It's Dinosaur King because yes, because I love Dinosaur King. It's my absolute favorite series of di of things related with dinosaurs in my life. Because yeah, I even like it more than Jurassic Park because because like this is the first dinosaur thing I came up as a as a kid and my class my entire class was into it where we traded cards dinosaur king cards pcg ones not the arcade ones like those were the hit in my in my days so anyways to revive the series i decided to go for this one this gameplay because you know right now the real me is probably studying you'll you'll see the exact details when we get into the series when i reveal more about my background story about this game but anyways you guys probably saw the thumbnail, 90% of you guys are here because this one reason. I finally figured out how to get every single dinosaur in this game. So, so guys, okay, let me get into the details. First, there is a site where you can get all the codes, but the thing is, the code doesn't work. And I finally figured out why the code doesn't work, and I'm gonna tell you guys what happens if you accidentally put in the wrong code. So. Just in case you guys are following the video with me, uh, go ahead, save your game right now. I'm not gonna save it because I'm right now in the middle, I figured out while I was in the middle of the gameplay series, so I, I had to stop the video and I had to like make this video right now. So anyways, save your game, something goes wrong, you need to go back because if you fail with this glitch, your game may, may become unreviable. Unrevivable. Uh, like the game's dead. You need to start from ground zero all over again if you uh, accidentally miss, uh, do something by mistake. So let's get into it. So the code itself is uh, on this side. So yes, it's kind of Korean because uh, I use Korean. So anyways, because I am Korean. So on on GameFAQs, GameSpot.com, this guy. Uh, named uh, Megasonic36 has shared a valuable find and this is where you guys literally came and this is the supposedly the code that summons every single dinosaur but there's a trick because if you guys enter the code and yes this guy says the two X's must be replaced by the index number of the dinosaur you want these will be discussed in the next session which is basically a list of all the dinosaurs but if you put in because I can test it out right now because if i do uh the game will become unreviable because that's this is how you activate the dino bot glitch the dino doll glitch and that the thing is if you just replace the x with uh, any dinosaur you want from the list and if you dig up a fossil the fossil will be placed in when you press select on your game which i'll go into detail uh, soon enough and if you go and if you dig out the fossil you won't get the dinosaur you desire, but instead, uh, you will have a T-Rex fossil, uh, and if you dig out the fossil, the do uh, it will say, it, do it won't say any dinosaur name, but it's gonna say Dino Doll. I'm not sure what, what, it, what the name of the bot actually is, but that's like basically the, uh, the doll, so it's basically the test subjects when the devs were working on, the when they were developing the game, so yeah, uh, that's how they kind of experiment him they they can experiment it with the doll when they were like designing the game cores core mechanics and if you uh actually put in the code the wrong way then the dino doll will come out but the problem is once you actually create the dino doll you can't exit the game that like, you can't save the game just pauses randomly and that's why i said you guys in the first time to save because if you don't save then the dino do dino doll will be just on your screen and you can't go back you can't move the dino doll away like it's just going to be stuck on your screen so let's get to the details so this is the code so of course you guys i I already copied the code. So these are all the numbers of the dinosaurs. I will put it in the comment section just in case you guys are too lazy to go ahead to decide itself. So uh, so these are all the code numbers for the dinosaurs that you can find. So yeah, very nice, 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 beautiful. Super Alpha Dinosaurs, Secret Dinosaurs, Ace, Paris, Terry, Tank, all your favorite dinosaurs from the animal. All of them are in here. They are actually in the game. So yes, for those uh, that are actually... Um, Rookies, uh, not rookies, I mean, 
the one the people that have kind of been already playing this game and know everything they know you can get the dinosaurs via the stone circle password kind of thing but that, that only unlocks this, uh, some dinosaurs like Paris, Ares, Ace and Tank and stuff you don't get to unlock the Therizinosaurus, the elusive Megalosaurus, Deinonychus. Like, these are all the dinosaurs that I always wanted when I actually played on the 3DS myself. But uh, I never got them because you can't get them because you, I, you need to put in some code on the DS, which is which I never figured it out. But on an emulator, it's possible. So, these are all the dinosaurs. So... I am gonna get myself, um, let's see, what dinosaur do you want? Um, um, Dilophosaurus is my favorite, but it's not gonna be as impacting as, uh, usual. The alpha dinosaurs you can get when you complete the game, uh, let's see. Um, no, oh, how about Deinonychus? That's, oh, no, 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 not Deinonychus. Uh, you know what, yeah, let's test that on two dinosaurs, I'll need to test that anyway, so. Deinonychus! 68 R remember the number so 68 68 don't forget i got a memory of a goddamn goldfish so 68 don't forget so what you do here go to the menu go to custom cheats uh add in plus uh, by the name write in the dinosaur name that you want but you actually don't have to uh, necessarily uh uh but thing is uh you better do that because if if you don't, well, then you won't be able to realize what the, um, what the, what you may call it, did not, uh, what, what code belongs to what dinosaur anymore. So, here's the problem. If you write in this code, and you say, okay, and if you activate the code, the dinosaur will come out, and it will destroy your game. But, see, what I figured out is that this guy made a goddamn typo Well, he was gonna write this. This isn't the code! Like, this is the code that summons the Dino Doll for the Deinonychus, but this isn't the Deinonychus that you, you can play with. Because this guy made a critical mistake of replacing the 7 with an F! So that's the uh, that's why the code didn't work. The code is wrong. You need to remove the F, put in the 7 instead of the F. See? This is the code for the Deinonychus. Don't press the F. Alright. So this is the Dino code. So enable cheat. Go back. Oh. I forgot to save. I forgot to save. All right. Uh, there we go. Now, enable cheat, save. So, always remember, uh, this cheat activates itself by pressing um, se um, select. So, you guys can't really... If you really pinch, you might be able to see because I lowered the, uh, the button sensitivity for the Nintendo because it's kind of distracting for the viewers. So, from aesthetically. So, you need to press select. So right now, let's see, uh, restoration room, you will see three European fossils. These are just normal European fossils that I got while I was playing the gameplay. So let's press select and let's see what happens. Nothing happened. If you go in here, well, three European fossils, just as normal. However, there's a small change because you actually got the third one because the fossils go from the bottom up and stuff. So... Actually, I don't know, uh, because the Deinonychus, if you spawn it in, it appears as a European fossil. So now, I don't know which is the actual European fossil, and I don't know which is the which is the Deinonychus. Is it the top one or the bottom one? How do the fossils come in? Do they override the top one? No, I think that's only when the bag is full. I don't know. I remember. I don't remember. Uh, I think it was the bottom one. Well, all right. So, I'm not gonna go ahead and become a digging expert here, because I'm just here to show you guys, uh... Nope, that's not uh, the Deinonychus, because, as I said, if it's the Dino Doll, the fossil will be a T-Rex. And if it's the hacked dinosaur that you managed to get in by a code, the spi a Spinosaurus, fo a Spinosaurus fossil will come out. Like, not the Spinosaurus with a sail, but, like, the Baryonyx. So, this is a normal European dinosaur. Yep. Alright. So, then it's you! It's gotta be you! Alright, let's see how this is gonna work. Yes, you can see the fossil head, yet yeah, it's a Spinosaur head, which means, correctly, you did- Congratulations! You managed to hack yourself in the dinosaur that you always wanted. So, let's go ahead and let's dig this baby out of the rock, shall we? 
There we go. Believe me, guys, I, I can do way better than this, because but I need to show you guys. Uh, I don't have the time to do super precision cleaning, alright? I'm gonna delete this guy anyways. So. Ta-da! Deinonychus. So this is what's the thing. Don't go for 7. Press F. I mean, no, no, don't press F. Go for 7, yeah. So. Name? No. Right now, it's just, you're just a test subject right now. So. So what if I want to have another dinosaur? Let's see, I want uh, Awaken the Parasaurolophus, which I actually didn't even know that was in the game because you can't actually play as Zoe, so... Because you can't play as Zoe, so I have no idea how you can get the Parasaurolophus, but... Well, let's see how it's done. So, in order to do that, you actually need to go to the uh, custom cheats and you need to disable the Deinonychus because do not activate two dinosaur codes at the same time. I don't know what's gonna happen but if you press select one of these dinosaurs are gonna come in but they both uh, replace one fossil by uh, uh, when you press select so which means that um, I don't know which one is gonna come out it could be like either Parasaurolophus or Deinonychus but it might be even be a dino doll and ruin your entire game. So, as I said, I'm not so sure. So, do it at your own risk, but it's always safe if you just turn off the dino cheat. So, let's see which beautiful dinosaur uh, the Parasaurolophus is. The Awaken the Parasaurolophus. It's number 39. All right. So, let's go a activate uh, Awaken the Parasaur. Okay. So, now let's activate our code. 38, was it? Right. 38 and don't go for F go for 7. That's the most most important thing I'm here to tell you guys So enable cheat save now you got that so now you go back and now you press Select once again, and now if you come in Restoration room, uh, I think this is it. So let's clean up this one All right, so just as always, it's a parasol of, uh, uh, not parasol, it's a Spinosaurus fossil. So, yep, congratulations, you you got us up your dinosaur. So, ba -bum 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 -bum, just destroy. I'm Rock Destroyer. Alright, let's see how it's done. Um, nope, I think I used the wrong code. Uh, it's not 38, was it? Uh, I don't know. I don't know, I must have forgotten. It's it, it it's probably not 38 for the Waking Parasaurolophus. I said I told you guys I had the memory of a goldfish. But anyways, guys, you guys now can see how the dinosaur codes summoning works. So, so guys, um, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. And just in case, if you want to support my channel, because... It's like this video is gonna be one of the videos where new people are gonna get attract uh. attracted to my channel with this video. So, but yeah, if you guys don't know, uh, I actually had a YouTube channel a long time ago, um, which got hacked. I had more than four thousand, uh, more than four thousand subscribers, which I all lost due to a hack incident. And now I'm a small channel with back to only like seventy subscribers. So, if you wanna like. Congratulate me for the te uh, lo tons of effort I put into researching to figure out the proper code to summon all the dinosaurs. Go ahead and subscribe because, like, it's really gonna help me out. Because, like, you know, I really don't feel so well. So, anyways, guys, if you have enjoyed this episode, leave a like. If you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe. And until next time, may the Jurassic Sprit be with you. Bye bye.